Alright, what up people? Welcome back to the channel. It's your favorite YouTube couple, Claire and Drew. Back at it with another video. And this is going to be part three of Vegan Week. Technically, we didn't post a video yesterday because... Why didn't we? We just had a boring, like, mundane yeah. day. But I did make these really good tacos last night. Oh. And I did film, like, a little clip of it. So I will insert that... Here. So yeah, those tacos were bomb.com, and what we're doing today is we're going to go to a vegan restaurant. Now, I don't know what a vegan restaurant is. Claire hasn't really given me any info on it, but she says, I've always wanted to go here, and now that you're vegan, we're going to go. It's and like pretty much the only... Don't ruin it. Oh, sorry. Is no, I was just... No, I wasn't going to ruin oh. anything. It's pretty much just like the only all-vegan restaurant in our area. Mm. Well, there you go. Oh, it's all vegan? Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah, hopefully, yeah, hopefully there's something I can eat. Oh, man. What do you mean you can eat? You're vegan for the week. This is yeah, like the perfect thing. Yeah, I know. And I need you guys to let me know in the comment section below because Claire believes I need to go until Sunday, but I was thinking work week, like Monday okay. through Friday. So like, I'm done Friday night and I'm going to rip into some pizza. No, be done Sunday because I leave Saturday. No, no. Yeah. So I have to go vegan on my own? No, no I'm no. saying, I'm saying, like, I don't leave till night on Saturday. I know, but you leave at night on Saturday. Why don't we, like, hang out Friday night? You can eat your we could end chips the vlog. and I'll eat my Wait, pizza. I have a good idea. We could end the vlog, like, with brunch on Saturday and you can get, like, your thing at brunch. That would be fun. But I'd rather have pizza on Friday night and watch a movie. Okay. So yeah, we just decided, I was going to ask you for your guys' opinions, but to be honest, I don't really care because you're not the one doing Vegan Week, and all you guys saying there's no way I was going to survive, no way I was going to yes. do it. I'm on, it is now Wednesday, Tuesday when we're recording this, Wednesday when this video is going live. I am over halfway done, only a few more days. You even went to the movies and didn't break yeah, it. Yeah, I know. That's tough. My brother ripped into some cheeseburger sliders, and I had nothing besides a coke. That's where we're at, so we're going to go ahead and splurge on a freaking vegan restaurant food we will document it and that's probably it for this because maybe we'll eat something later maybe i'll get jack-in-the-box fries later i don't know it just depends on what's going on you know but uh yeah we'll see you at the restaurant and hopefully i don't hate my life after we eat there hopefully my life is actually better but let's go right now boom 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 when am i gonna actually grab it when am I actually gonna grab it? When am I gonna do it? I'm gonna what? drive off. What? Right now? You want it right now or we right now? We gotta get going. Right now? Okay. Okay, so we made it, but unfortunately this place is in the city, which means there's like no good parking. So we parked pretty far away. We got three and a half mile walk. It's like a block away. Pretty much three and a half miles. And I hate walking to restaurants because if I eat, I'm gonna be full and I don't wanna move. But oh well, let's go to the restaurant. It looks pretty, pretty vegan-y from the outside. I'm not gonna lie. It looks exactly like a vegan restaurant would. You might think it is in like a dirt, like hill with grass on it, but it is more vegan than that. So I'll show you in a second. <laughs> Whose feet are who? Take your guess. I'll give you a hit. Mine are the van, or not the van, <laughs> the other one. All right, their menu is quite intense. I wish I could find a restaurant non-vegan that had this many options. Like literally, look at this menu. There's more options here for vegans that should be on a normal restaurant's menu than there are at normal restaurants. It makes no sense. I got a quesadilla. Why? Can you try I think it tastes exactly like bacon. And he does too, he just doesn't want to admit it. All right, so Claire Bear decided to get a vegan chocolate milkshake. I did not because I'm not brave enough. You know how long this been. All right, so we just finished. Um, honestly, and this kills me to say it, <laughs> my opinion, it honestly wasn't bad. I mean, this stuff, no offense, babe. It, none taken. Was like pretty good tasting. And it's not because Claire doesn't make good tasting food. It's just she's never made a bacon cheeseburger vegan style for me. 
And honestly, I if I was blindfolded, I wouldn't be able to tell it wasn't a real thing. I would say, however, the bacon on it was very weird, but it tasted just like bacon. Yeah, no joke. like it was like weirdly, uh, like the texture of it wasn't like crunchy like bacon. Like if they would have pan fried it maybe like a little longer, then it would have probably like worked out a little better. Yeah, like it was like... But the taste was... Uh, the taste honestly was spot on, but it wasn't cooked good. That's the only issue. Yeah. But if they cooked it good and then gave me that and I was blindfolded, I'd say uh, it's a bacon cheeseburger. Honestly, no joke. But if I looked at it, I could tell that meat yeah. was not meat. You know what I'm saying? But honestly, overall, it was a much more pleasant experience than I was expecting. Only though, like, is it Coke, like normal Coke vegan? They have like the real cane sugar oh, sodas, to, not a fan. That, they used to have that one at Fuzzy's, don't you remember that? They used to have the yeah. exact same soda. Like, I'm not a big fan of the cane sugar. I like the real fake stuff, you know what I'm the saying? <laughs> the real fake stuff. Can I talk about what I got though? Yes, yeah, so here's Claire's description. I got a quesadilla and like, I've been craving a quesadilla for a long time. A long time. So I got a quesadilla, and then I got... <laughs> this person next to me, I don't know if it's Claire or what it is, she put down that chocolate smoothie faster than I've ever seen someone drink anything in my entire life. She went full shoe nice on that milkshake. You guys know who shoe nice is? It was literally so good though, but my stomach... <laughs> Yeah, the milkshake wasn't nearly as good as she's saying, and I'm assuming it's because she hasn't had a real milkshake in a, in a well, long time. I had something with like sprinkles and like whipped yeah. cream, like. Yeah. Now this uh, this milkshake tasted like cocoa powder and water. No offense. But yeah, honestly, um, if you guys are like me and you're not vegan, you're normal people, I would highly recommend trying it with an open mind. And yeah, but we got there, I was looking at the menu, I'm like, holy mother of God, what am I supposed to choose here? There's about 9,000 things. The guy said, get the freaking big kahuna, which is what it was called, and I got it, and I ate it, and my God, it was not bad. I won't say it was a delicious, but it was not bad. You were telling people to go into things with open, open mind? No, on that. Like, if it's a vegan restaurant like that, now, if your girlfriend says, I made you a vegan bacon cheeseburger, don't eat it. <laughs> it will not be good. Don't do it. Don't think about it, just go to this place, what was it called? Spiral Diner. Spiral Diner in Dallas, Texas. If you oh, guys want don't, to don't think that just because I had a milkshake, that stopped me from getting the cupcake and the Andrew a brownie. Yeah, Claire's a straight psychopath. I hope this place shuts down because Claire's gonna be like, babe, can we please drive 39 minutes to go get a quesadilla? And I'll be like, why don't we just go get a quesadilla and make it ourselves? Just don't put me in it and you'll be good, sweet cheeks. That was a little rude. Yeah. My bad. But yeah, I know this video was kind of quick, and uh, but it was like our first little... Like, again, we did... All I had today to eat was a smoothie, and then I had some rice, like, bean thing. I don't even know what it was. And then we went to this place, and I figured this place would be a much better yeah. video than um, whatever. And that was my first vegan hamburger. Like, no joke. My very first one. Oh, yeah. I've You've never, never even had a bite of mine. And Claire makes like the Beyond Beef burgers, never eaten it, I don't think. If I have, it might have been one bite, but I'm 99% sure I've never had one. And yeah, it does, is that taste like Beyond Beef burgers? Uh, yeah, Beyond Beef burgers have like a little more taste to them. It's better than that? Yeah, the actual like patty itself. Wow, okay, well there you have it, folks. But yeah, that is going to end the video. If you enjoyed it, slap that like button. And subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. One. I said the next one. <laughs> Bye.